Hi, today we will work on reporting an incident, a V2 cut with an engine fire after relighting flight. This happened yesterday. This is AE approach. Let's start up. Welcome again, my name is Santiago and in this video I will give you some tools to report a situation that happened yesterday, including an elegant speech pattern, connector use, and for the more advanced speakers, we will also take a look at how to enhance these reports to achieve the higher levels of proficiency. At the end of the video, you will find some exercises to practice these strategies. Stay tuned. So let's take a look at the situation. It began with the aircraft lined up on the runway, ready for takeoff and with clearance for departure. Now let's imagine a timeline and we will see each one of the events separately. So here we have our timeline, which begins at 0000 UTC with takeoff thrust, at 02 UTC rotation, at V2 engine 2 fail, at 05 Mayday, at 15 holding pattern, at 17 engine 2 relight attempt, at 19 engine 2 fire, at 25 landing, at 27 emergency response. Here we're going to show you a table with each one of the events. Now let's make phrases with each event. At 0000 UTC, the pilot flying set take of thrust. At 02, the pilot flying performed the rotation. At V2, the engine 2 failed. At 05, the crew declared the emergency. At 15, the aircraft started to hold. At 17, the crew attempted an engine relight. At 19, the engine caught fire. At 25, the aircraft landed, and at 0027, the emergency response team extinguished the fire. So, in order to make an elegant and more technical report, we are going to use a new strategy. We are going to take the phrases in which a person or an object applies an action to another person or another object, and we're going to change them. Let's take a look at some examples. Our examples are going to be the pilot requested more fuel, the government closed all the airports, and the cabin crew reported a broken seat. So now we're going to take these phrases and we're going to change their formula. We will use the object of the sentence, then was or where, depending on the appropriate use, and we will use the action in the third version to finish the sentence. So now our examples. The pilot requested more fuel, or more fuel was requested. The government closed all the airports, or all the airports were closed. And the cabin crew reported a broken seat, a broken seat was reported. Now let's apply this formula to the sentences of our event. The pilot flying set takeoff thrust becomes takeoff thrust was set. Now, the pilot flying performed the rotation becomes the rotation was performed. There are specific sentences that we can't change like this one. Leave a comment telling us why. The crew declared the emergency becomes the emergency was declared. This one we can't change either. Leave a comment. The next one, the crew attempted an engine relight or an engine relight was attempted. This next one we can change, but we shouldn't. Let us know why. Next one, we can't change it. And finally, the emergency response team extinguished the fire or the fire was extinguished. All right, now in order to make a smooth report and not just list some events, we must connect the sentences to build a sequence. Here we have some connectors that could help us achieve this. Here we have a very short list of possible connectors. So the report, 
at 0, 0, 0, 0 UTC, takeoff thrust was set. Two minutes later, the rotation was performed. Reaching V2, the engine 2 failed, and following that, the emergency was declared. After 10 minutes, the aircraft started to hold, and then an engine relight was attempted, but the engine caught fire. Eventually, the aircraft landed, and the fire was extinguished. Now, here are some strategies to enhance your speech production. You should try to include different connectors, cause and effect, reasons, connectors to add information, etc. We can include implicit information using according to the regulations, according to the manuals, or even the SOPs dictate that we, etc. Use a higher quality of vocabulary for precision purposes. And at the end, you could include a personal analysis of the event using words like certainly, definitely, probably, etc. At 0000 UTC, takeoff thrust was set therefore initiating the roll. Two minutes later, the rotation was performed normally. Nevertheless, upon reaching V2, the left engine failed out of a sudden, and following the procedure, the emergency was declared climbing out of 400 feet AGL. After 10 minutes, the aircraft joined the initial approach point hold, and at that point, the crew initiated the procedures described in the SOPs, which probably include an engine relight. But the attempt was botched as the engine caught fire, Eventually, at around 0025 UTC, the aircraft landed uneventfully and the fire was fought to a successful outcome. All in all, the emergency was handled according to the manual with the aggravating circumstance of the engine fire, which most certainly complicated immensely the decision-making process. Okay, in this video we studied strategies for incident and accident reporting that happened in the past. Before we finish, we would like to know, what is the grammatical name of the strategy that we reviewed in this video? How can you use it outside of the aeronautical context? Let us know in the comment section. Thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe and activate the notification bell. Share with others, hit the like button and leave a comment. This was AE Approach. I will see you next time. And now for the practice exercises. I want you to study them well and then build your report while recording yourself. Then listen to the recording looking for the errors or weaknesses that you could improve.